In this video, we are going to download and integrate admin template into our project. Go to Google and search for Desk App Admin Template. Click on the GitHub repository link. To preview this template, visit this URL. Friends, this is the template we are going to use. It has almost everything we will need for our project. To get this template, just click on the download zip link. Once download is finished, extract the zip file to your desktop. Now we have the admin template on our local computer. We need to add this template's SRC and vendors folders inside projects public folder. Open the back folder. Copy and paste the SRC and vendors folders inside the public slash back folder. Next, open pages layout.blade.php file. Go back to the template. Select a blank page. Right click and view the page source. Select all and copy the entire page markup. Paste it inside the pages layout.blade.php file. We need to make some changes on this file. Remove unnecessary content. Add the at yield directive for the dynamic page title. Add the at stack directive for custom styles.
Add the at stack directive for custom JavaScript scripts. Also, add the at yield directive for dynamic page content. Next, open the web.php routes file and add two new routes to test our layouts. After that, run php artisan optimize command. Let's create these two views. Inside the example page.blade.php file, extend our pages layout. As you can see we can access the example page route. But CSS, JS, and images are not correctly linked. Go back to the pages layout.blade.php file. Our file paths are not correct according to our project folder structure. To fix this issue quickly, press Ctrl plus F. Replace all instances with the correct paths. As you can see, the file paths are updated. Good, example page is completed.
Let's apply the same to the auth example page. The example auth.blade.php file must be directly inside the views folder. Like pages layout, open auth layout.blade.php file. Go to the template and select the login page. Right click and view the page source. Select all and copy the entire page markup. Paste it inside the auth layout.blade.php file. We need to make some changes to this file. Add the at yield directive for the dynamic page title. Remove unnecessary content. Add the at stack directive for custom styles. Add the at stack directive for custom JavaScript scripts. Also, add the at yield directive for dynamic page content. Next, extend auth layout inside this example auth.blade.php file. Correct CSS, JS, and images paths in the auth layout.blade.php file. To fix this issue quickly, press Ctrl plus F. Replace all instances with the correct paths. As you can see, the file paths are updated. Good, example auth page is completed. Let's remove the register top link. That's it. See you in the next video.